As the founder of TNA, I get to make a lot of easy decisions and also get to make a lot of tough decisions. Well, this was an easy one. So it gives me great pride and honor to announce tonight the fourth and final member of Team Jarrett. And let's welcome him back, Christopher Daniels. AJ Styles, I don't think that you will ever question the loyalty or integrity of Jeff Jarrett again. And as you can see by AJ's reaction, he is absolutely thrilled that his best friend, Christopher Daniels, is not only back in TNA, but Daniels will join AJ Styles, Jeff Jarrett, and Samoa Joe against the main event mafia in Lethal Lockdown. And this just shows you how wishy-washy that Jeff Jarrett is. Obviously, this is a decision to placate AJ Styles for earlier deciding with Kurt Angle. I mean, the guy doesn't know what side he's on. I mean, at least the lockdown, I gotta be watching this guy because there's no telling what he's gonna do. The only clue that we had was that the mystery man was a TNA champion. And Christopher Daniels fits the bill, former multiple time X Division and multi-time world tag team champion. That bond, that relationship, between AJ Styles and Christopher Daniels. It goes way beyond wrestling. Don, even you know that AJ Styles has named his children after Christopher Daniels. Jared, Jeff Jarrett, the owner of TNA, I am asking you as one of your wrestlers to come out here right now and make this justified. I want you to watch the replay and get your butt out here now. As we went to break, we received word that Jeff Jarrett was entering the TV truck. One would presume that he had a chance to watch a replay to review the pin. You mean, the, you mean the controversial pin? He's coming out here and he better make the right decision. It's time for Jeff Jarrett to man up here. Kurt, Kurt, listen. I just came from the truck. I've watched the replay from several different angles. Booker, shut the hell up when I'm talking. Kurt, Kurt, come here, listen to me. Scotty's between me and Kurt, listen to me. I've watched it over several times. I realize what's riding on this decision. I realize that this is gonna affect all eight of our careers, possibly. I realize this determines the man advantage. Roll the tape, Keith, roll the tape. Daniels initiated the offense right there. He initiated the offense. Very, there's a three count right there, Kurt. He initiated the offensive move, Kurt, you know it. Kurt. As, as the founder of TNA, I realize, like I said earlier, I have to make some easy decisions and some hard decisions. And whether Jeff agrees with it or not, I have to make the right decision. Therefore, the winner of the match is Kurt Angle. Yes! The right call! He did it! Yes! Just when we thought that Jeff Jarrett had answered any possible questions about his loyalty to Team Jarrett, this controversial situation arises where Jarrett overrules Jim Cornette and gives Team Angle the man advantage for lethal lockdown against Team Jarrett. I mean, look at those guys. There's no question about it. There's no way that Daniels and AJ can trust Jeff Jarrett. And... Oh, ho, ho. Things are going from bad to worse for Team Jarrett right now. Lockdown is going to be epic. The stakes just got higher. Who's going to take control this Sunday? 